you expect me to talk? No, Mr. Dipshit, I expect you to play snooker and be very good at it at the same time. That's going to be the intention anyway. Hopefully we can play uh, well today. <coughs> As we take on world number three, Mark J. Williams, the Welsh party machine. Um, it's been indifferent uh, in this tournament. We've been uh, in bit indifferent as far as forms go, but uh, hopefully we've got that out of the system so we can get out there, get the boys on the bays and have a great game against the world number three and beat him as well. So here we go then folks, the Paul Hunter Classic, Elliot Slesser to fourth round. There's the manly handshake between the two and let's get off and underway. So it's the captain to break off. Yes, we, we don't want to talk about uh, the last match because the last match we were um, quite pathetic, quite poor, quite piss pants sir. Uh, if we're being completely and totally honest. But uh, hopefully, you know, like I said, we've got that out of the system. And uh, the good old captain, he can uh, move on. And uh, make good of uh, he needs to be careful a bad situation. Of, not this. of course, if he doesn't move on, as uh, Mark goes into the side of the pack there, he's left nothing. If he doesn't well, uh, that's move that's not on, worked out quite as he intended it to. Then, uh, well, I say he's left nothing. Will Dipshit uh, fancy this he one? He needs to be mindful of not under-hitting this shot. Oh, he's rattled the jaw. Oh, but one's got in the top corner. <laughs> he's fortunate. Oh, there. nice one. And what? he's on the black as well. So yeah, like I said, it was a bit uh, indifferent with his form, but uh, yes, he'll get past that. On. He's moved on. Black's not in. Oh, so close. And the reds are Needed spread open there, here. He didn't get it. Elliot Slesser. Ooh, that one. Uh, could be interesting. So that uh, you don't want to be missing balls against the uh, Welsh here. potting machine. One. But if you start missing balls against him, then uh, you're Four. going to be in a lot of trouble. The green goes down. Let's see what's uh, next. Five. He's put another red in. Go for the black mark. Of course, why not? Twelve. Mark Williams. Experienced veteran, experienced campaigner, and a bit of a perennial moaner. 18. Blue goes in. The red, he'll be on the black. 19. Although, will the black go through that alley of reds? Oh, easy. It's like, uh, he was being guided then. 27. It's another red down, another black down, another 34. black bites of dust. In goes another red. 35. And the black. 42. What have you played for here, Mark? Oh, he's played a safe. Mark oh, Williams. that's not 42. safe. Somebody should get on the phone to Mark. That's uh, not a safe ball there. He might... Uh... He's taking this red on. Might want to have a word with himself, but... Oh, look at the screw on that. Is he on the black? Is he on anything? He's on nothing. One. <laughs> wow. Oh, well. Let's go for the black, then. Hit the black on the uh, side here and try and get up the table. Pace is key, and he certainly doesn't want to overhit this. We've completely missed it. And he's gone it off. There's a trick shot for you. He's gone in off. Foul and a miss. Elliot Slesser, one. Mark Williams, seven. Ooh, that's a mistake from Mr. Williams. And I tell you what, is that red next to the pink bubble? Because it is. We'll, uh, we'll take that on. Well, he's taking it on to the left corner. Down it goes. Red goes in. Now, will we take a long One. blue here? Which is a dipshit speciality. The question then becomes, where does the next red come from? 
if you take the long blue. He's aiming for the left corner here. That's an excellent. <coughs> I think it comes from the bottom cush in there. Or maybe it comes Six. from that one near the black. Maybe it comes from that one near the black. He, he's going to top corner him. No, he's not. He's going to go. For, he's going to go for the sensible one. This should be pretty straightforward. He'll go for the sensible one and uh, make Would sure you believe that. It? But it didn't go in. Elliot Slash. Well, six. Would you believe that? One. Mark Williams, one. And nor did that one. This red. It's another one of those matches. What a great shot that is. Where we're being frustrated one. here. Just like we were with uh, Xiao De Gong. I hope uh, we can get to uh, dipshit in some well, kind of potting this mode. Into the because right pocket. if not, as the blue goes in. That was a good blue. I must, uh, I must admit that one. Because if not, this could Six. be a long drawn out match. And Mark Williams will win a long drawn out match because he's a fucking grinder. He's also a gricer. This looks relatively easy. He's also quite a number of things as the red goes in. I think he's on the black here, dipshit. Excuse Seven. me. If I know him, he's going to play for the red on the cushion. I'll just go play on the red on the cushion. Oh, we may play the one near the pink. 14. Nah, I'm going to get the red on the cushion out of the way. Slow roll it. Or maybe you could stun it in. I don't know if I'd be stunning it in. Hit him. What What do I know? 15. I, I know nothing here. I'm, I'm just a poor sod that commentates on the stuff. He, he's the dipshit. I don't even know what he's playing here, because he, he could be playing for either red here. I think he's actually playing for the one that's uh, closest. Yeah. So that'll go in. He'll stun back. Probably play for the pink in the same pocket. Aiming for the centre pocket here. What a top And then probably that roll through for the p red in the opposite pocket. See, now I'm starting to get an idea of what he's like. As we have a scratch on the side of our head and we pop a spot, that's uh, not good. So in goes the red. Nine. So pink. Red next. Now, what colour are you going to play on? You could play for any colour. Color, there, there, that's easy for me to say. Any colour you like here. Looks like you're going to play for the. Oh, I don't know. What are you going to play for? 30. Okay, green. I like that shot. The natural angle takes it up towards uh, the yellow. I like that shot. He's in full dipshit mode now. As long as he doesn't snooker himself. 33. Nah, he's fine. He's fine. He'll, stump. He'll screw back now. Green in the opposite corner. Only the colours remaining. That'll probably be 02 to tell me my bill's ready. 35. I know it's not. He's looking to pop this into the right corner. Beautiful. Green in, He's brown. right on top of next. his game at the moment. 38. Next for the blue. This looks relatively straightforward. Are we going to be top side or bottom side? We're going to be bottom side. Oh dear. 42. I don't know why, but I can't get the quite yet the hang of top side of the bottom this side of the blue. Relatively straightforward. To get nicely back up for the pink. I think if I'd played that a little harder. 
Of if anyone's got any tips on the how to do top bottom side of the blue onto the pink, that would be uh, it would be now. much appreciated. In the meantime, the pink does go down. Unbelievable pass. And the black for and the that total clearance. He shuts out his opponent in this frame. Fifty-three. Well, the pink was all we needed. Black's in. That completes a brilliant and that clearance. Completes frame Very number one. Impressive. So, Captain Ditch it, folks. Sixty. Good job. First, he's established a one-frame lead here. Some pretty impressive snooker. Mark Williams break. Thank you. Don't think he's left without any snooker, mate. Williams. So that's uh, usual. Thanks, Mark. That was awfully nice of you. What, what did I ever do to you, eh? What, what did I ever do to you? Look at the bend we're having to put around this green just to make contact with something. The this could go wrong. Is, where does the cue ball end up? Very wrong. He's played that very well. Although I do do think, to be fair, it does look like we, Mark's having a good think about this. Wow, he, he I think did he hot the thing. Wow, Elliot, he Slater, did hot the thing. Six. Well, let's see. Oh, we're what taking he this. You gotta he take this to advantage. He's put you in all sorts here. Take advantage of this one. Tell you what, are you down on the black here? That is a cracking shot to get on the black. One. The amount of control screw he had to put on that uh, cue ball there. And there's another bit of control screw as well. He's got Eight. choices here as the dipshit. Excuse me. <coughs> Unfortunately, he's not got the control, the uh, shot he wants, so he's going to have to uh, go into the middle, I think, here. Unless he fancies that red. Well, I don't know about that. I wouldn't have took that red personally. He's looking at this red. And there's why. Nine. Now you've got no choice but to play for a yellow. Although with the reds as split well, as they it are, goes half a chance. Finding one off the yellow shouldn't be too hard of a problem. You may collide the pink here. Good shot. That frees up all the reds. Eleven. Oh, look at those four around the black spot. Does that, does that look like I can work a beauty? The only problem is you can't get on a bleeding colour. It's got to go uh, pink it. Well, no, actually, I don't. Can he cannon Is into he that and get on the balloon? Red in. Oh yes. Great positional shot. He'll be happy with that. Well, it's the problem with the cannon shots. You can never uh, guess where they're going to end up. So I think he's going to try and play for this red in the middle here. Got a nice bit of control screw. He's a little off. 17. He'll play for a bolt colour here. I don't know which uh, one he's going to play for. Probably play for the brown. 18. Yeah, brown, uh, we called it. Another bit of a controlled screw to get south side of this red, and that is twenty-two. Well, I'd say that's just about perfect, folks. The only problem he's going to have is he's got to somehow get on the blue. Well, he's on the blue. Twenty-three. But he's also on the pink. Okay, I see that. That's a good shot. Just wants to sink this into the left corner pocket. In goes the pink. 
And in it goes. And he's on A Great red. I don't know which red he's going to be on. 29. Oh, he's on the one below the pink. We're going to screw it back or stun it through. He's going to stun it through. Pink in the middle pocket. And then, Thanks. well, take your pick, really. Breaks at 36. You'll want this to drop into the centre pocket. Stun. Excellent pop. They'll be on the red into the same pocket, I there. assume. Really good. 36. Look at how fast and fluid the dipshit is now. He is going for it. He is going and gunning. 43. Red at the top, he'll probably again stun this in so he can be on the pink in the middle pocket. There it is. 44. He's took a wide uh, variety of colours here. The only colour he's not taken yet is a green. <laughs> Playing for the middle pocket. Tremendous if shot. He clears the table, he'll get a Brimming green. with confidence and on a bit of a roll at the moment. 50. He's going to play for this one in the middle. Well, that's a very acute angle. So, red into the uh, middle. And hold for the red, sorry, red into the corner and hold for the pink 51. in the middle. Playing for the middle pocket. Which red he's playing for here. Pink is in. Not the shot he was aiming for there. I think you don't play for that one he looked at 57. earlier. But like I said, it's such an acute angle, you've got to get it spot on. He really doesn't want to underhit this shot. And that is spot on. Tremendous shot. Good shot. Tight Just into the corner. A, position a shot. good shot. Superb. 58. This pink Under required. Control screw. No problem there. Take the uh, middle of the red the three, on three reds on the uh, left side, right side there. 64. Have a guess what colour he might be on after this, folks. That's right, if you guess pink, you win! 65. I don't know what you win, but you win something. He's looking he at the may into play the that red center. on the bottom cushion here. Great shot! Or is he on the one next to the black spot? Oh, he's on the one next to the black spot. That is what you call controlled snooker play. From El Captain of Dipshits. And he's back on the pink. Into the 72. opposite corner. That kind of does free this uh, game up a bit now. In goes the pink. Seventy-eight. Red into the corner, my man. Red's in. 79. Pink into the middle, or are you gonna take a he's gonna take a black? Well, he's won the frame, he may as well. He's going for the left corner pocket. Black is in. That's a great pot. I don't think he's gonna like what the result of that is though. 86. Yep. That's snookered. That's end of rake. He's just going to hit some out of anger here. So that should be frame number two in the bag. 2 nil up, Captain Ditchett. Elliot Slesser, 86. He's uh, got some Cedar. form back. Frame, Elliot. Well, that's a 2-0 well, lead. A two frame lead now. It should be and a 3-0 really lead from here. To turn the screw if it's not, I'll be very surprised. Thank you. Because uh, bitch it has been on. Uh, well, he's actually been on the uh, song today, which makes uh, a change.
There's the break off. And that's going to go behind the brown and up onto the bolt cushion. Okay. Green in the way? I'd like the green to be in the way. Tempted by this no. red. That's straight in. One. And Mark Williams is off. Ooh, nice split. Eight. Could have been better though. Mark Ooh, Williams. Ooh, cheeky. He's left nothing. Cheeky Welshman. Cheeky Welshman was filmed in front of a live Welshman. Meh. Hey, you cheeky Welshman. Oh, that's a big stretch, I tell you. He's playing the safety and aiming to get the cue ball tight against well, the cushion. Well, that might be too hard. Oh, it is. But he's going to come back and get away with <laughs> Oh, dear. Mark must have been looking at that and thinking, you lucky jammy shit. That's an excellent shot. So, uh, yeah. It's going to be a uh, nice little bout of safety also, coming up yeah. here now. Up and down the bulk line, getting behind the yellow, getting behind the yellow, getting behind the yellow. Oh, I tell you what, that red might be open. The safety battle continues. It is. Is it in though? It's in. Brilliant. What a man. So here goes the Welsh potting machine well, again. Oh, he could went for another split, and that didn't Superb work out for him. Shot. One eight. He's got another split. He's knocking them out a few at a time here. And this, uh, that's not necessarily the best way to go about this. But uh, the good thing about Mark is he's a machine. He pots and he pots. Oh, he missed the black. Mark Williams, 17. Machines even have a tendency to break down. So, yeah. We need two. No real problem here. Get on with it now. 3 nil is beckoning. If you want it, that pink could have been better. One. He may only be left with the green. And if he is, he's not guaranteed to be on a red after this. He needs to be careful of not overhitting this. He is not guaranteed to be on a red. That's a loose shot. That Four. is a terrible shot. So, another bout of safety. He better know what he's doing. Shot pace will determine if he success or failure. We're here. in trouble. Is he in behind the brown? In behind the brown. Not quite, but I'd be interested to see that red on the side cushion. He's not even looked at it or entertained it. I tell you what, speaking of entertaining, I think uh, we'll give that a red a go. Not a straightforward safety shot here. What it's a in. top pot that was. What we'll takes a fancy a blue? It's got to be a blue, hasn't it? A blue and try and run for it while well, he's looking at the black. Well, he's now looking at the yellow. Why are you looking at the YOLO? I think he's playing this with a lot of power. Why were you looking at the yellow, dipshit? Ooh, nice shot. If you're on something. And I don't know Three. if that red pot. I <clears throat> damn sure. Oh, that is so tight. That is so, so tight. If I was you, mate, I'd be playing... Well, he's looking at everything now. i tell you what, has he seen that one... Uh... Did he see that one on the side of the cluster? That was a long red. The under hits he would have thought he'd have taken that one. I don't think it goes. 
I don't think it goes. Oh, it almost did. Oh, it almost did. That was a really tough shot. That would have been it a hell of a shot that if that well. went in. Elliot Slesser, three, one. But uh, as per the uh, Eight. normal terms and standards of agreement, it's now time for Mark Nine. to get a frame on the board. <laughs> As he does his uh, best flight of the bumblebee 17. impersonation. That's 22. a good thing about the uh, AI shots. You can speed them up. 23. You can speed them up so if you're going to take a pound in, you're going to take a pound in uh, quickly. 30. And no, Mark will be all over in the uh, flash of an eye as well. 36. 37. 44 45 There we go See, look, look how quick uh, he's gone through that There goes another red 53 There's a black 60 Will this red go in? He, he was actually Mark snooking William, on it 60. So we'll call it a day there And uh, move on to the next frame Mark William so you had one frame Thank mark. You, the frame. Just because you got one frame doesn't mean you're going to get another frame off me. So let's see. Uh, always hit the. Oh, I thought he hit the blue then. Ah, uh, forty hit the blue then. So now, what does a dipshit do? How much dipshit could a dipshit do if a dipshit couldn't dipshit? Won't want to underhit this shot. Oh, that's a bit pacey. Where's the cue ball gone? Foul. Oh dear. Mark Williams. <laughs> oh, he's elected to play on here. Well, we asked for that one. I imagine Mr. Williams is going to take the red near the corner pocket, and uh, we're going to be doing another flight of the bumblebee impersonation. Here we go. Eight. Oh, he's not on the red. Oh, but he's Mark left Williams. one. Eight. He's left one. I'll tell you what, I don't know if you can uh, get through or not, but if you can, have a go. Well, it goes. Half a chance here. Flicked Beautiful off uh, red, so he's on the black. What a shot by the dipshit. One. What a shot by the dipshit. My only question is, what's uh, what's your next play? The red above the black? Well, it's got to be, hasn't it? He Eight. might, if he fancies his luck, try and uh, bang into the reds here. The angle's there. He's does aiming he to sink this it? into the right corner. Yes, he does. That spread is not bad at all. Now, are you on a colour? You're on the pink. Everybody applaud that shot from the dipshit. There's that nice. was control personified. And it should be a frame winner now. He should be in the balls and he should be and about ready to go. Red. 50. However, he could have played that one better. He's still being a dipshit. <laughs> so this red I into the corner. The rest is required. But it's him. He's on the black. 16. It's a straight black as well. So perhaps he could uh, play about there, and he's got a choice of reds after that. He's got one into the middle, he's got one into the corner. 23. He's going to take the one into the middle. Again, could Position have played that a little better. 24. That's in. Played it well. Yeah, he 
he might be on that red near the cushion. Not the one he's near, but uh, that one. Here it goes. He's on the black again. Nicely onto the colour. 32. Well, now what do you do? I think you really, you've got a hold for the pink, haven't you there? Hit into the pink. No, he's stunned between the pink and the red. I, I tell you what you might think of it. That red, the, uh, the cluster 39. of three. That might be available. Yeah, that one. It is. And then what are you going to do? You're going to screw back a little or you're going to run through? He's going to run through. He's on the black. <laughs> Nicely onto the black. Uh, on. Never doubt the dipshit, man. Never doubt the dipshit for one second. That's too much top. That's too much top. Where's the cue ball gone? Didn't play that one well, did you? 47. No, I, I see what he's done. He's left himself a long red. He always leads himself a long red. Well, he's taking the red on. And it's in. Oh, what a shot. And he's on the black. <laughs> He'll be very happy with the position here. We love the dipshit. 48. We do. We love the dipshit. We do. We're going to get that chant going. <coughs> We're also going to suggest the uh, quiet. What the hell was that shot? Oh, he's on one, though. Oh, that's tight. We've got to really slow roll that one in, dipshit. With the pace of this shot. And he does. That's a but he's not on the pink. Or is he? And the cue ball has finished or very is nicely. He? No, he's not on the pink. 56. Blue, maybe. If he takes the blue, I can see him trying to hold for the red that's in the bulk in. And if that goes wrong, he's got the two that are over by the side cushion there. Oh, he split it. That was a great shot. I didn't see the split. 61. So pop this in, and I imagine he's gonna be on the blue again. Wonderful shot. Yeah, I want to see the cue ball lift up a little bit there. Give me a little 62. kick. I'll get a kick out of you. no one. In goes the blue. Are oh, you on a red? You're on a red. On a red, and he should be back on the black. Sixty-seven. He's like Amy Winehouse. He's back to black. He's lining this one up to the middle pocket. What a top shot that is. He seems full of confidence at the moment. Dipshit may have said goodbye in words. Very important. But he goes this. back to red and then goes back to black. In it goes. That should effectively remove any ideas his opponent may have. He's got him red into the middle. 75. He's going for the left centre here. And then it goes. Well, an excellent pop. Now, what's your next move? 76. I'm going to take the pink on. Pink, I imagine it's going to be a fair bit He's of looking to pop uh, this into the left corner pocket. Here. Beautifully done. 82. You have to stun across the face of the pink. Oh, that didn't go well. It's still on it. 83. But he may go a different route now. And that route may be the yellow. I think they're He's trying to get for down the to this red here. on the uh, bottom here. In it goes. He's going to get there. Now. <coughs> He's not asking to I was going to get to that red 85. over by the cushion. 
That's the red that's uh, going to be key here. The frame is one. So he's through to the next round. I think that angle on the pink is pretty damn perfect. Because you can stun up behind the red. You're into next. You're uh, on for a century. He's attempting to sink this into the left corner pocket. Oh, he's missed a green. That's good. It could have been better. If I'm being honest, it could have been better. But if it goes in, he's going to look like a genius. If it goes in, he's going to look like a genius. Ah, that's there a top you go. shot. 93. Genius.exe. Are you on the yellow? You're on the yellow. Are you on the right side of the yellow? Excuse me! You are. You can just stun across in behind the green here. Just the colours remaining on the table now. What a century. Well, it's wow. not the best angle. 100. If we're being honest. I have to slow roll this. Oh, and it's not there. Doesn't matter though. Frame, Elliot match, Slesser. Elliot Slesser. Done, Frame dusted. Conceded. Thank you very much. Frame Goodbye, and, and God bless. He threw to the quarterfinals. Another indifferent game, but uh, competitive nonetheless. Well done. Well, that's him uh, done and dusted out of the way. Good, good, good job. Ding, ding. So, next up for Captain Ditchit will be the world number five, the Pistol Mark Allen. Still not been invited to the Six Reds Championship. I would like an invitation, please, if that's all right. Could climb to... I'll still stay 64th, but he'd be a bit better than uh, what it was. So that's going to uh, do it for this game, folks. Thank you for watching. I hope you, uh, hope you enjoyed that. We're uh, going to go see you next time behind the ball line. So until uh, next video, take care, everybody.